quick video just to show you how you can use Desmos to plot your circles, your point, um, where the tangent line hits and your normal line hits the circle, and also plot those two lines. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to come up here and just click in one of these Desmos windows. I'm going to type x squared plus y squared equals 25. And you see that's going to give me my circle here. Now, there's a couple of things you can do if you hover your mouse over it and just left click, you can move that around. Also, if you scroll up and down on your mouse, it'll make the image um, bigger and smaller. Okay, so I have in there my circle. Now, let's say I'm going to put that point of intersection in the problem. I believe that's 3, 4. So I'm going to open another one of those windows. And I'm going to put parentheses, 3, 4, close parentheses. You notice that there's a red dot on my circle now. If I want to label that dot just underneath the three fourths where it says label, I'm just going to click that and you'll notice that on your graph, now you have the point labeled. Okay, now I'm ready to go ahead and plot the equation of the tangent line, which I believe is y is equal to minus three fourths x and then minus 25 fourths. Looks like that's actually the one that's down at the other point there, so I don't know, that might be plus for this one. Let me see if that's it. There it is, plus 25 fourths. So now you see that there's the tangent line that hits the circle at the point three four, um, and I've gotten that from um, my derivative. So you can use this to actually get your image and then to export it Come up to the top right, you'll see the arrow up that says share graph. Click on that, and then down here it says export image. And then you can change the size of the circle and line, however you like, and then just click on download PNG. It'll download that to your computer, and that's what you can upload.